Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to make your Windows 10 toolbar look like this. And guys, if you are new to my channel, please be sure to hit the subscribe button. So guys, without wasting any more time, let's get on with the video. Okay guys, first of all, you need to download these two applications. So the first one is Icons 8 Pigeon App. And also you need to download the Translucent TB or Translucent Taskbar whatever you like to call it so you can download these two softwares from microsoft store i will put the download links in the description box down below and also if you get any problems downloading with the microsoft store i will also put links to download these softwares from the web so once you download the applications go ahead and install the applications so first i'm going to show you how to middle your applications in the taskbar so to do that you need to right click on your taskbar and then you need to unlock the taskbar so click on lock the taskbar and then it will unlock your taskbar and now again you need to right click on your taskbar and click on cortana and if it's not hidden click on hidden and now again right click it and also if you turn on the show task view button also turn that off after that again right click it and click on toolbars and enable links once you do that at bottom right corner you will see the links and then beside that you will see these two stripes so you need to bring them all the way onto your left side and once you do that your applications in your taskbar will appear in your right side and also for your applications you will get these two lines so now you can center these applications and guys keep in mind once you center in these applications you need to put your applications slightly to your right side because once you right click on your taskbar once you click on the lock the taskbar your icons will be go little bit to your left side so just center the applications with slightly to your right side i think these icons is not centered so again i'm gonna right click it and then unlock my taskbar and then i'm gonna center this and also at your bottom left corner you will see the links text so to remove that right click on your taskbar make sure the taskbar is unlocked and then you need to uncheck the show title and also uncheck the show text and now you can right click on your taskbar and click on lock the taskbar and that's pretty much it with the centering part and now let's open the software so first i'm gonna open the translucent tb and you need to click this arrow that shows the hidden icons click that and here you will see the icon to translucent tb software click on that and then from regular to task view period these five options should be set to clear so as you can see the regular is clear maximized window is also clear start menu clear code now clear task view opened is also clear make sure these five options is clear once you do that your taskbar will be look transparent after that you can add the icons so to do that uh, you need to open the icons 8 feature nav double click the application to open it up and once the application is open it will look like this so it says a new update is available i will uh, update it later so i'm just gonna click on no thanks and here at the top you will see a like a circle click that and then you can change the color obviously you can change it to any color you like so for this i'm gonna go for white color and then you need to click here and then you need to go to the ICO, click on the ICO and then the 16 pixel and the 32 pixel will be checked. So you need to uncheck these pixels and then you need to turn on the 64 pixel and turn off the 16 pixels and it will give the maximum quality to your icons. So make sure 64 pixels is turned on. And now at your left side you will see lots of tabs. From this I'm gonna go for Windows 10 tab and here you will see lots of icons so you can search for any icon you like so here i have the premiere pro software i pin to my taskbar so i'm gonna search as premiere and then you will see the icon so before that you need to right click on your desktop and click on new and then you need to create a folder and now you can call this folder as icons and then you need to open the folder that you created and now you can drag and drop the icon you want to this folder so as you can see guys the icon is little bit small the reason for that is once you click here the um, pixel rate is 16 pixels and 32 pixels i think it randomly changed so 
again I'll turn on 64 pixels and then turn off the 16 pixels and 32 pixels and then I'm going to delete this icon and now again I'm going to drag and drop the icon onto the folder and now you can search for any icon you like so I'm going to search for the applications in my taskbar So guys once you put all of your icons that you need to this folder you can close the application and also you can close this folder and now what you want to do is you need to unprint every application in your taskbar. So to do that right click on the application and click on unprint from taskbar and then it will unpin that application. So you need to repeat the same process to all the applications in your taskbar. Okay. Once you do that, you need to click on your Windows logo and you need to search for the application that you need to put to the taskbar. So I'm going to search for Premiere Pro and then once you search for the application, right click on that and click on open file location and then it will open the file location of that software. After that, right click on the software and click on send to and click on desktop and then it will create a shortcut in your desktop so you need to repeat the same process that you need to put your taskbar so guys once you put all of the applications onto your desktop again you need to right click on the application and go to properties after that it will open the properties window and then you need to go to the shortcut tab and here you will see option change icon click on that and click on browse and now you can go to the location where you saved the icons so I'm gonna go to my desktop and then I'm gonna open up the icons folder and now you can choose the icon that you need to put to the software so I'm gonna use the Premiere Pro logo click on open ok apply and then ok and as you can see guys now the Premiere Pro logo turns to the icon that I need so now I'm gonna pin to my taskbar so I'm just gonna drag and drop it to the taskbar and then it will pin that software to my taskbar and then you need to repeat the same process to the every application that you create a shortcut in your desktop. Okay guys, once you change all of the applications icons, you can link to the taskbar. So just drag and drop the applications onto your taskbar. And as you can see guys I put all of my applications to my taskbar and my taskbar is look like this. So for some reason the audacity icon is not changed. I think the problem is I'm recording so that's why the audacity icon didn't change. And now you can right click on your desktop and click on view and then you can turn off the show desktop icons. And boom that's how you can get a clean desktop and also that's how you can make your windows 10 toolbar look very cool and clean. And yeah guys that's it the video and if you make this far in the video please be sure to like subscribe and also put a comment what type of video you need in the next video and i will see you guys in the next video peace